Well, a terrifying moment for passengers aboard an American Airlines Boeing 767 when the plane caught fire just before takeoff. At least 20 people suffered minor injuries in the incident at Chicago's O'Hare Airport. And the National Transportation Safety Board will now begin the investigation into what could have been an airline catastrophe. CBS News transportation safety expert and former chairman of the NTSB, Mark Rosenker, joins us now by phone. Uh, Mark, good to talk to you today. DeMarco, good to be with you. Do we know what started this fire? That's the big question. Well, at this point, we have preliminary information indicating we had an uncontained failure of the engine, which in fact then uh, created the explosion and the uh, subsequent fire. You know, the fact that something like this, uh, obviously, clearly, that it could happen is always frightening uh, to know and to see as we look at these pictures here. How common are incidents like this one? Absolutely very rare. Although only a year uh, ago we saw a British Airways flight uh, have the same type of situation, and also another uh, independent carrier uh, had an uh, engine failure uh, that uh, created a fire. But when you put it all into perspective, 30,000 operations a day, takeoffs and landings, uh, equaling somewhere close to 85 million takeoffs and landings since we had our last fatal accident in the United States by a U.S. carrier, and that was in February of 2009 by Colgan Airways. Now, we did have a fatal accident from an, a Korean carrier a few years ago. Uh, three people were killed uh, on uh, landing in that particular accident from Seoul to San Francisco. Three people were killed. They were ejected from the airplane as a result of them not wearing their safety belt. But obviously, uh, planes are, are, are thoroughly checked uh, before takeoff. How do you give the confidence back to passengers that something like this just won't happen again? Or, as you said, this is possible? Well, it is very, very possible. But uh, you saw the results of the incredible training that the pilots had, recognizing they had an issue with that particular engine. They aborted the takeoff. The uh, cabin crew did the right thing in being able to expedite these people's evacuation. Um, there were some injuries, but that's not unusual when you jump down a slide. But these were very minor issues. We're talking about for the last actual fatal accident from a U.S. carrier in the United States, four billion passengers have flown safely without incident. All right, you're the expert, Mark Rosenker. Always thanking you for uh, joining us. You bet.